Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So, before I start talking about what I'm going to be talking about, I should probably point out that right now, uh, Pink Fox is not with me. Uh, usually, is in case recently hasn't shown, she's usually around with me or she's um, just like right across the street from where I live at her job she used to have. Emphasis I'm used to. That's because she started working a new job recently, as we've discussed before. Because of that, she is actually up north from our home at the moment. And, well, because of this, I am alone. I am alone. Well, not really. I was actually going to video chat her later, but the idea of that kind of got me thinking. Seclusion. I'm surprised I haven't talked about how the impact of seclusion yet. So we're going to talk about that today. <sighs> seclusion can be a very good thing or a very bad thing. It really depends on the circumstance. So let's take one uh, example from both. And we'll kind of go off, I'll go off of my thoughts on that. In a bad, when it comes to the bad sense of it, um, it, it would be one of those circumstances where you're kind of cooped up in a room with absolutely nothing to do. And you've got like, I don't know, hypothetically, let's say you have ADHD, for example. People with that kind of circumstances can just lose their mind. Um, when it comes to being secluded and alone, you leave it, you're in that position for too long and you'll go nuts. I mean, this is how some psychopaths are born, for heaven's sake. Or sociopaths. Not literally born, obviously, but metaphorically. A lot of people have... I've noticed recently a lot of people have a tendency to take what I say literal. I'm talking about metaphorically. I hope. Well, anyway. I think that's a good example of a bad type of seclusion. Um, When it comes to good seclusion, well... Sometimes someone just needs a breather, and you need to be left alone for a bit. In which case, simple. Say, hey, I, I, I need some alone time. I'm going to head out, just go for a walk. Don't worry about it too much. I just, you know, I need to take a break or something. You head off. Bob's your uncle. You're on your own. You're secluded in a room where no one's around. I don't know, maybe 10, 15 minutes later, you come back, and you're like, all right, we're better. Let's get back to what we were doing. And, you know, in that sense, seclusion could be a very good thing. I was going to reword it a bit earlier, uh, like differently earlier, but then I kind of realized something. Time. Time is kind of the main essence of when seclusion can be got either good or bad. In the sense of it being good, it's a short amount of time. When it's bad, that's when you're doing it for too long. It can mean a couple of different things. Either you're being secluded from the world out of fear, you could be secluded for, like, out of force for some kind of reason, or you could be secluded for your own good. It really just depends on the circumstance. Um, but personally, I, I, I'll, from personal experience, I've had both ends of this kind of circumstance go on, and yeah, I'm not going to lie, I prefer to be secluded only in this on the front that I feel like I need to be left alone. But otherwise, yeah, seclusion is just not something that I'd want ever to have to go through. This is just kind of personally myself, though. Uh, people, could, people could be different just based on the circumstances, but yeah, that one's just me. Anyway, I don't know. I'm going to leave this here. I know this is a bit shorter. I was expect I, I was expecting this to go on a little bit longer, but if I talk about this anymore, it's just going to go on a loop. What are your guys' thoughts on the topic? Let us know in the comments below. Um, if you have anything else you'd like to be spoken on, discussed on this channel, uh, let us know down there as well. Want to check out any of the discussion and rants that one of us have done on here? Click the link on the side of my head over here where trying to take you to one of over 200 of those at this point. Um, or if you're looking for something that 
different, something that might float your boat a bit better, click link on this side where YouTube will tell you that. Not quite what you're looking for. Why not check out the channel out itself if you have not yet? In the meantime, we're going to head off. Thanks again for tuning in this video, guys. We hope to see all of you in another. Bye for now.